Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to another video of Marvel Contest of Champions. We are running Variant 7, Chapter 2.2, Easy Path for Completion. Now this is a very, very fun path and the combination of nodes just make it a really fun ride. So there is going to be Flare that increases your damage by 400%, but you take 100% of your damage back every second. And Stun Vulnerability is when the opponent is stunned, you do extra damage. Apart from that, there is Physical Perfection, so your all uh, other champions except skills class have their damage reduced by 50% and on top of that there is heavy assault so if you use a heavy attack you do extra damage by 500% so it's a really fun part starts with Angela ends with Electro so you will discuss more in that just bring in skill champions with some good critical rate and this is a very fun path the boss is going to be a spider Gwen with counter strike enhance abilities by 20% bubble sheet and stack overflow we'll discuss more about her once we get to the fight so yes guys let's jump in right into it and before we do guys make sure to like the video subscribe to the channel and turn on those post notifications all of that really helps me out a lot Now the first defender is going to be an Angela, all you need to do is to parry and heavy and you will see the damage all stacking up and also I am running a bleed, increased bleed with the, both the black panthers together so that's 25% extra bleed so parry and heavy and all of those extra damage just combines up with the flare, with the heavy assault and stun vulnerability and it's just a fun part that you can work around with. There is no, there is no much tips and tricks about this video, you just go out and have fun, just bring a team a skill based team that can rip through most of them easily that Ant-Man might be a little annoying because of his glancing but just keep hurrying and having your way out of this and you can easily bring him down as well Next up is going to be a Modo. Now again, this is uh, the only technical thing here that if you don't have a champion that can bypass the Astral Evade, all you need to do is to wait for him to go into his power gain mode and once he is in power gain mode, you can just use a heavy. You won't get the bonus from the Sun Vulnerability node, but the others you can just kill him off very quick. And then we have Abomination Immortal, again same thing, I'm using a blade here and I'm getting class advantage plus all the bonuses from the nose that is Sun Vulnerability, Heavy Assault as well as Physical Perfection and within 3 heavy attacks you can easily kill him off. Next up is Captain Marvel movie version. Again, this is just a fun path. Enjoy yourselves, just parry and heavy your way away. You just need to do it three or four times, and the bleeds and all the damage will take over and kill off your defenders very, very quickly. It's literally the easiest path in all of Variant 7. And the final defender before the boss is going to be Electro. Now he might hurt you if you use another champion and then go past the Electro damage. It might cost you one or two revives. If not, just bring in a champion that can bypass it or just parry, your heavier, uh, parry and heavy your way uh, out of it. You have five champions. Even if you lose one or two, it's fine. You can go on the third one. But I'm sure you can do it in one champion only. Now the boss fight is going to be a spider Gwen, so there's a lot to uncover here, so let's get right into it. So she will be aggressive with her nose, so she will not stay back and block mostly, she will always be dashing in and always be trying to hit you. Apart from that, she will have counter strike, so whenever you use a dexterity, the attacker gets a fury and give, increases his damage by 5%. 
but at 10 Furies you lose all of them and then the defender goes unstoppable for 15 seconds. So it's good and a bad in a sense that I have to manage your Furies so you can get extra damage as an attacker. But if you do too much ducksing more than 10 times you give the defender unblockable uh, for 15 seconds. Then you're gonna have enhanced abilities so she will be evading much more. Also bubble shield so if you're gonna uh, parry her remember the 10th after 10 hits the 11th will be unblockable so keep that in mind so having discussed all of the nodes uh, i'm going to use a falcon who makes a fight super easy you just stay back use your lockdown and then just parry and start hitting her she will not evade so most of the champions that are anti-evade will work nicely here the uh, hug buster works really well here you can also use a uh, black widow the og version with her subtlety she won't let her evade also Black Widow Deadly Origin with all of her shocks, it will be really good here. As well as Nick Fury, once he goes down uh, to his LMD at 30%, he cannot uh, the defender cannot miss her evade, he bypasses them. And the new champion that is going to Jabari Panther, she will work really well here as well. So yeah, you can just easily bring her down, just bring in anti raid champion and that's about it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a very short one, just 6 minutes, but because the path was really fun. If you enjoyed the video, guys, make sure to like, share, and subscribe it, and turn on those post notifications. All of that really helps me out a lot. And apart from that, I hope you all have an amazing day, and I'll see you next time.